getting bad every day. Terrorists operating in Kassina State have reportedly abducted some children and relatives of Secretary to the State Government, SSG Mustafa Inua. According to a report by Kassina Post, the abduction took place in the Musa local government area of the state. It was gathered that the incident occurred on Wednesday on his farm in a village called Daftau in the afternoon. These are children to the Secretary to the State Government, SSG. <laughs> Some children and relatives of the Secretary to the SSG, okay? Some of his relatives, you know that uh, they are only, they have a very, very tight uh, security. You know, I said this, that these politicians, the only thing that can really affect them is their direct family. But if you say cousin, uh, uh, uncle, auntie, or, you know, he... It's, they should be it should be part of their family but even all those ones they don't even they don't care not to talk of uh, the general public you see the general public they want to care about until it happens to them directly but before it will happen to them it's, it's going to take a long time because they all already secured they've already secured their own children perfectly well you know if your cousins are maybe you are lucky to stay with them fine but he's very rare so even if your cousins your their nephew nieces whatever aunties uncles <laughs> you know you're your own no? you're on your own the whole thing is just getting 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 tougher and tougher and so bad every day Arewa leaders should confess every evil act done against this country there is no peace for the wicked the chickens are coming home to roost when you dine with the devil remember he has no allegiance to anybody no allegiance to anybody very sweet idea they should kidnap the big men and leave school children. Please, bandits, go after Yusuf Buari and kidnap him and cut. Oh, you think uh, it's, gonna, it's not going to happen? Forget it. Forget it. It's not going to happen. Excellence, they should continue kidnapping the people on top of government so that they would find solution to it. Fight against Boko Haram is a fight against the North. Who made this statement? Good morning. The rich also cry, no e wind blows anyone good. If these bandits can be dealing with the people uh, in government and these rich politicians, it will be better than dealing with the poor masses. They are in charge of security in the country. Their failure to do the needful should be reflected on them and their families. Bandits, please leave the poor alone and go after those siphoning or looting Nigeria treasury, go after them and collect your shares. Buhari will declare these criminals terrorists when members of his family are kidnapped. And how, how will they be kidnapped? They can't be kidnapped. That's what we are waiting for because they are so selfish that they secure their own. You see that Buhari cannot take treatments in Nigeria. I say because he has been doing it for God knows when. So he has to continue. So he, I don't know. He doesn't even care. Even with the way people are shouting for where, do even if you don't want to, at least do let. If people are really enjoying something, then you not decide on your own. Uh, at least that is what we even call patriotism. If you cannot even, if you can't buy Nigeria and grow Nigeria, then who are you preaching that to? Hypocrisy, honestly, is 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 the watchword of the president. You people are not even enjoying anything. If he still came back, it's he, not bothered. He's not saying anything. The presidency is not even saying anything. You know when they challenge them. When it comes to the issue of hyper, when somebody challenges them, they will respond. But when they are doing evil, they will just keep quiet as if uh, they don't even know what is happening. The issue with some soon come to an end now. Very good. The movie is getting more interesting. It's moving gradually to the doorstep of the untouchable. Formerly, it was the children of the have-nots and the masses that bear the bronze. Now, they also feel how painful it is for your children to be to be captured these children are not is direct or biological children so it's it makes no meaning to them or it does they don't even understand it they do not understand the language good news mm -hmm. it's spreading home states of the president is just things are just getting worse day by day yeah yeah me we will not catch a big fish the Fulani bandits are 
sending signals of the expectation when they eventually enter the south secure your environment now it's true secure your environment now we would have thought that they would have used a they will be using fulani s men to come in and it's not even only fulani s men a lot of people are saying it but people, i don't even know why is it because of a the hardship or because of what that even some people are giving signal signal to what will happen even especially lagos that you think they don't have farm you know their problem is not a uh, even s men but you have them in another form as okada riders they are all over the place go to all these uncompleted buildings they are all over the place even the place you think that's a they it is it is well secured you will still see them find their way doing all these uh, mini mini jobs or especially those uh, uncompleted uncompleted building you see them there they will keep themselves there and people are just watching and we see all those governments all these people who, who you think that they ought to know better they go abroad they see what happens but they come back home it's a different thing altogether if we can have a regular nigerians who travel abroad so what is their own that is now making them seem as if uh, they have not seen life before because of position i don't just get i don't just get it's so so pathetic next level doings say baba the rich in government political class teach them what is good for the goose is also good for the gander try hard and kidnap the animal called buhari in Asobo. good news go after the politicians who brought you the hardships and those government officials who steal the public wealth just go go after them the coast is clear no hiding place for the mighty men in nigeria no one is free they can kidnap worry if care is not taken the high and the low in the society are not spared now not terrorists you people should not go after the poor again okay after the rich go after the rich <laughs> it's unfortunate really really unfortunate so how do we move from here that is the question how do we move from here